Welcome back to another game of Pauper Burn on Magic the Gathering Online here at Andromeda Galaxy. So, I got the die roll. I'm going to play first. Always play first when you burn. This hand is excellent. I've got three one damage burn, or three three damage one mana burn spells, Neonate, Needle Drop. So, as I've been doing, Neonate, turn one. This guy's been putting in a decent amount of work. He's been a good enabler for Needle Drop and... He's helped draw me into gas when I need it. I was pretty skeptical of him at first, but now I'm like, eh, he's not such a bad guy. He's insolent, but, you know, I can look past that. Okay. So here, I believe I need to drop. Attack. I need to drop. Draw into more gas. Needle drop. Draw into more gas. Okay. There we go. So Needle Drop's pretty sweet. That was another card I, when I was looking at decks. I was like, huh, okay, well, I'm just going to do this and draw gas. <laughs> so, fine with me, bud. All right, um, I think I just Chain Lightning you. Yep. Chain Lightning you. And then I'll hold back that bolt. Put my opponent to eight. Pristine Talisman, they gain life off of that. Gross. So I have to constantly put pressure now because they're going to be gaining one every turn. So Curse of the Pierced Heart would be pretty good here. All right, that is not a good draw. So now this could be bad. This might be... Um, Blue Black Flash. Mall Drifter. Okay. And hindsight, I should have saved that mountain. Might live to regret that. Because I could have triggered that on it. Boom. And then if I got another burn spell, I'm, that mistake may cost me the game. Because it would have been 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 exactly if I just mm -hmm. held on to that mountain. It was foolish of me. So they're drawing cards. End step. Neonate. Here's Neonate. And now I will pass. Neonate will set that back, but if they just have a go at me... Oh, if they try to get rid of the Neonate, I'll just let the Neonate die. There's nothing I really want to discard. That Searing Blaze could be useful and it could save me from the Drifter. Demir Signet, that's fine. You could play that. Don't care. So they got six mana, which means they can flash back that Bojukabog. I don't use my graveyard for anything, dude, so it's all well and good with me. Assuming okay, that's not coming at me. Searing Blaze again. Uh I'm gonna attack with Neonate. Swing a ding ding with Neonate. You can't block it. Cannot be done, friend. Disfigure. Uh, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna do it. See what I get. A searing place. <laughs> uh, how unfortunate. Okay. Um, I just wait. So if they don't play another creature, what I might do is just. Searing Blaze. What are they doing here? That's a lot of mana. Another Maul Drifter. If I get a land, that'll be awesome, because then I'm just going to Searing Blaze both of those. And then that's six damage right there, putting them at six. Yeah, I might just do that. Needle Drop. All right. Um, right. I'm just going to Searing Blaze here. Red, red. Agony Warp, okay. That's fine. It resolves. Fizzles. Oh, no, it doesn't fizzle. They take one. I guess I Needle Drop you now. Then I play this Mountain. And then I Searing Blaze this. There we go. Okay. 
Not looking too horrible, but that pristine talisman is such a pain. They've gained well over a bolt's worth of mana from that, or life from that. So it kind of stinks. Ah, Gurmog Angler. That could quickly do me in. Hmm. This just appears to be blue-black control. Deep analysis. I was gonna, if you do the flashback, I'd be more than happy for you to do that. Such an insolent neonate. Okay. So what I might do here is tap, blast, chittering rat. Uh, do that. Just fire blast you. And then block sack the neonite. Agony warp. Oh, I can't do it. Discarding the card is part of the cost. So I can't do it. That's fine. I'd rather use that fire blast than have it stuck on top of my library. I'm at 13, so I'm dead in two turns. Another fire blast, okay. Hmm. So I could still potentially win here. I'm taking seven. This is the defining turn here. What you playing? Mall Drifter? Okay, that's fine. So if I draw a bolt here, or any damage spell like that, I'm in good shape. Searing Blaze is not enough. Okay, um, I just lose the game here. Yeah, because four, yep. That's it, I concede, go to the next game. Inside sideboarding. Pro Professor Oak, I cannot ignore your girth. All right, I think incinerates would be better here. Smashes will be good. I do not like the searing blazes. I mean, it hits a couple things, but nothing too much. Hmm. Smash. Do I need all these smashes? Nah, probably not. Probably go down one of those. Maybe keep two blazes. Incinerate for more direct damage. I kept drawing a lot of fire blasts, so maybe get rid of one of those. And shard volley I can get rid of. Okay, we'll try that configuration and see how it works out. I feel like the smashes will be good, but I don't want to draw like a ton of them. Getting one just to blow up a talisman will be fine. Because the talisman is what really set me back there. Like, I could have fought through everything else with my damage and just won, but that talisman gained them so much life, it negated two lightning bolts worth of damage, I'm guessing. Okay, I'm going to keep this. This is sweet. So I've got my smash, I've got my neonate. Pretty awesome. So they mulled to six, play neonate, and pass the turn. That's fine. The unit will die. That's what you want to do, friend. Okay. Kelvin Marauder. Boom. Take one, and then we'll pass. So I don't like F6ing because I've seen other people get screwed over by it. Hey, that's fine. Take another one. But I don't like F6ing because I, I fear that I'll F6 through my own turn. I've seen people do that before, and uh, it sucks. Kevin Marauder. I'm just going to keep applying pressure where pressure is needed. So if they play, I hope they play that Talisman this turn, and then I'll just smash it. Smash it to smithereens. Agony Warp? Alright, that's fine too. Been doing... They take... You do damage anyway, it's fine. Okay. Chain Lightning? Yeah. Do chain lightning. Boop. And I can always lightning bolt them. Gonna do it. They're down pretty low. If they want to burn a counter spell on that, 
more power to them. I just pass here and incinerate at their end step if they don't play anything. Hmm. Yep, incinerate. Needle drop, huh? Okay. Well, I can't do anything with that. Demir Guildgate, okay. Can't do anything with that. Curse, sweet. Curse is fine. So this will negate even more. Okay. You can prohibit that. Hmm. Signet. I'm going to smash that. Hopefully I got a land. Nope. Smash that. Boom. Take three. Ha! Hydroblast. Nice. Okay, well, I've got another one. Not the end of the world. Rager, alright. There we go. Smash the smithereens, boop. Do it again. Needle drop ya. I'm just going for it. Okay, so the smashes were awesome. I'm gonna go down one Searing Blaze. Nah, eh, yeah, I'll put a Shard Volley back in. Searing Blaze doesn't seem that great. Because if I die, I don't get the land, you know, I don't get it. And it just seems like I need to play out everything quickly to beat them. So I can't slow roll a land and wait for them to play one of their creatures. Alright. This is a good hand keep. I'm going to start by suspending that Rift Bolt. Awesome. Even better. Suspend that. Okay. Pass the turn. Burn's a fun deck to play in this format. It's almost... It's very similar to Legacy Burn, actually. Okay. So the sooner I get this curse online, the better. Oh, two of them. That'll be awesome. Next turn, I curse them again, and then I Lava Spike. But yeah, this deck plays a lot of the same burn spells that Legacy Burn plays. That's that's one of my favorite decks to play in that format. Chittering Rats, okay. Fine with me. Let's put that mountain back on top. Let's play that mountain. Play a curse. Boop, boop. And then you get Lava Spike, sir. Boom. This is going pretty good so far. Seven turns and they're dead off that alone. But they're going to take a total of six more, hopefully. Play stuff? Seagate Oracle? That's fine. I'm not going to be swinging at you, so... Hopefully I draw another... Burn spell. Fire Blast here would be pretty sweet. Especially while they are... Mountain. Also not terrible. Do that... Spike. Okay, you're at six life. You're dead in three turns. This is exciting. Pristine Talisman. Okay, you can offset some of that damage, but you'll still die in four turns. Chain Lightning. Going for it. Do you have the Hydro Blast? So you'll be at one next turn. Because they'll gain a life off of their talisman. If they're smart. Yeah, okay. Didn't think you'd let that go. So, alright, you have this turn to answer these. Mall Drifter. Okay. Will it be good enough? All right, eked out another win. Good game, opponent. Interesting matchup. I'll see you guys in the next one.